All right, so um, <laughs> I guess I kind of need to apologize here a little bit. The last intro, uh, I guess my acting skills were so good that I actually got three or four or maybe five people um, with the joke that I made about um, Lomberg dying. It was, it was a joke. Obviously, you know that, but I guess the acting skills were too good, so I apologize. Um, it's, it's just been, you know, since the alien abduction and the anal probe and the near-death experience caused by all of that, my judgment's been a little bit off, so that's, that's my bad. We got Calgary tonight, and it is as cold as Calgary in this basement. It's about 28 degrees outside with a bunch of snow. Beautiful. Now, Mason Marchman's out with COVID, and Sam Bennett is out with the suspension. Not great timing there. We've got Lundell at 2C. No problem. Joe Thornton draws back in. All right, we're good to go. And the fourth line with Ryan Lomberg is back as it should be. So I expect a good game. Calgary's tough defensively. You got Markstrom playing. You never know how that's going to go. Bobrovsky's in net. One or two things is going to happen here. It's either going to be really, really tight or it's going to be like wild and open because it seems like the when we're playing these teams from Canada and the Western Conference that we don't play a lot, it's been really, really chippy. Every time we've been playing one of these teams that we don't play all that often, it's been a lot, a lot of, you know, fights and aggression. And, and so don't be surprised. Don't be surprised if we see that. Big, big, big game to end this end this homestand before we go play Dallas and Carolina without Sam Bennett. Got to get a big two. So it's 3-2 Panthers, and we saw three hockey games worth of stuff in that first period. First things first, that's two power play goals. We scored two power play goals in one period. I'm shivering because it's so cold in here. I'm going to have to switch hats. My ears are cold. So we get two power play goals, Joe Thornton, all right? And then, you know, we give up two. Goudreau splits Eggblad and Uyghur like a freaking rotten egg. Boom, about a boom right in the back of the net. Brabovsky completely whiffs. And then I forget who it was for Calgary that scored. Basically, Brabovsky just left. There was like a quarter. There was like a quarter-sized hole. And uh, up against the post, guy banks it in. I forget who it was. I apologize. So we end up coming back. We were down. And we come back as usual. And it's 3-2 Panthers. Wide open. Not a lot of defense being played. Very, very chippy. Huberto looks like he's getting ready to get into a fight. Gudis hit a guy, hit his own face. Guy hit from behind. There's going to be a mess going on here at some point tonight. Um, this definitely has a look of like 6-5 to five final score. Let's keep on moving. But if it's one of those games where there's no defense being played, I, I like our chances. All right, all right, all right. 4-2 Panthers, Ryan Lomberg with the goal. Huh? What did I tell you? As long as he's alive, he should be on the ice. Both teams on a pace for a combined over 100 shots. There's no defense being played. And I don't mean that it's bad defense. What I mean is they're just not playing defense. Everybody, whoever gets the puck, just all five guys into the zone, and we'll see what happens. I mean, there's no defense. It's beautiful. Make this the Cup Finals right now. Just get these two teams in the cup finals. Uh, we all, just strokes and heart attacks, and it'll be beautiful. It's a beautiful thing. And this is missing Bennett and Marchman and Reinhardt, where somehow I forgot to mention Reinhardt. I mean, we're missing a very good second line completely, and it's just 4-2. This is beautiful. This is a beautiful game. All 
All right, all right, too big. Nice, two, three, four, five, six. Absolutely unstoppably ridiculous offense. I just almost 100 shots between the two teams, and it wasn't lopsided. In fact, I think Calgary actually outshot us, but Ruskin made 45 saves. They had 47 shots. I think we had 45. Just ridiculous. Beautiful hockey game. Like I said, make these two the cup finalists, please. All right, so Hornquist had two goals. Ryan Lomberg had one. So you know that fourth line I was bitching about last game? That's why. Okay? They should never not be together. They should just never not be together. If everybody is healthy, they need to be in the game. And, like, my brother's texting me, and he's asking me a very, very viable question. And it is, where does Noel Achari play? Where, who's sitting? If Achari comes back, if, when, whatever, who's going to sit? And I don't think anybody's going to sit. I think Achari will be like Thornton. And be a guy who gets in when we need him. Um, but you're not going to take Lusterinen out of that position. I don't I don't think so. I don't think it's going to happen. All right, Bobrovsky, we've seen this a few times now where he's given up a couple of early goals and then shut the door. And that is completely different from the guy that we saw here the first two seasons. Um, in the past, the two turn into four almost every night. And that has stopped. And that's just a beautiful thing. Going to need it. Going to need it, man. Because, hey, look. You see what happens with Tampa, with Vasilevsky. That's what we're going to need long term. Get into the postseason. And that's what this is all about, right? Everything here is about can we win the division, get the top seed, and then make it pay off for us in the playoffs. That's what it's all about. What else did we see tonight? Um... Mammon, looking good, looking good. I wish he would finish a little bit more, and I know that that's nitpicking. I grasp it, but if he's going to play on the top line, I mean, if that's really where we're going to put him, you got to finish a little bit more. But he's 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 playing he's playing pretty well. I know Reinhardt was out, Bennett was out, Marshman was out, so. You know who knows would have been who who knows who would have been up there anyway because I really feel like I like Huberto with Duclair so that top spot next to Barkov it's an interesting rotating position right because remember we had Marchment playing up there last year a little bit too so but right now with this team it doesn't matter who you throw out there on the ice it's five it's six it's nine goals almost every night uh, even Lucas Carlson gets in on the action tonight right. And poor Jacob Markstrom just doesn't know what the hell just hit him. Calgary came in with a tough, stingy defense. They've got one of the lowest goals against in the NHL. And we just whooped them, missing three of our best players. And that's, that's all we need to say. Now, Stu and I will be back tomorrow. Um, not sure if it's going to be our usual morning video or if we're going to have something later on in the evening. Don't know 100% yet. So if you don't see the review with Jaws and Stu up by noon like it normally is, that means there's probably something coming later on in the afternoon. So uh, that was it. I want to make this one short and sweet. Beautiful game. Just absolutely fun hockey game. The beat rolls on. We've got some big road games coming up here. Dallas, Carolina on Saturday is an absolutely huge game when it comes to what I'm talking about with winning the top seed and having home ice in the playoffs. So absolutely disappointing. Bennett's not going to be around. But, hey, <laughs> Lundell looked good. Lundell looked good. So we're good. We're good all the way around, Panther fans. Enjoy it. Absolutely enjoy it. Appreciate all the support. Make sure you hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell. I am back to doing the normal live streams, which is one hour before each Panther game. And then come playoff time, um... I'm, I'm just going to basically plug myself into the camera, and I may just stream straight from the time the playoffs start to the end of the cup, just like 24-7. It's just going to be, I'm saving up my energy now. I don't know what the hell I'm going to do come playoff time, but I, I, I want to have some fun with this because we got a real chance. So I'm not going to wait till next time. So All right, guys. Appreciate it. Big two.